So when you're shooting, guys, come around on the right-hand side, right behind around Jeff. So if I'm shooting competition, usually they want muscles down anyway. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be like, shoot, boom, boom, boom. I'm going to turn the gun over, grab two, and drop two off, drop one in, drop another one, and then grabbing them with dexterity in your fingers. If you have arthritis, this is going to probably hurt a little. But you want them to be curling so you can actually come over in the and then finish off with your thumb and then you can grab another two in the any questions it's real easy it just it takes a lot of practice you can quad load which this belt is not set up for there are four of shotgun shells closer together where you're grabbing four of them and you actually have to grab the very tip of the shotgun shell similar to this where you're just barely holding on to the, the shells and if you can make them so they're actually level and going in you can actually one and then you're going to roll your hand like this for the second two to go in it's a takes a little practice but it is definitely a lot speed just look up quad loading yeah. and you'll see these competition shooters in I was watching Jerry McCulloch's uh, daughter. Mitchell does, like, yeah. Cut, yeah, yeah like, she, uh, th there's a million ways, and not all our paw prints are the same size. Yeah. So you're going to have to figure out which rig is good. They actually have rigs that go across your chest mm -hmm. if you're going to do competition, and you can just start grabbing them off. And those are usually tight. You know, it looks like a stack of dynamite going around you. Really, yeah. uh, but semi automatic, they actually make, um, it looks like a shoehorn. And you can put like seven or eight shotgun shells on it and they're like magazines and you can just take them and shove them right into the thing and jerry mitchell uses one of those oh, he, uh, 